Jeff Wilson of the 49ers. They are facing Denver, and this is another situation with an injury to Matt Breida, which perhaps opens up opportunity. Yeah, similar to the Pittsburgh Steelers, who have already ruled out James Conner. The 49ers have already ruled out Matt Breida, which is great news for fantasy owners who want to go out and pick up Jeff Wilson because normally Matt Breida was one of these backs all season long where he didn't need to practice to play that week. He would randomly pop up on a Friday with a limited practice, and then he would end up playing, and it would be like uh, it would be a terrible situation for fantasy football. We don't have that right now. We know that it's going to be Jeff Wilson. Maybe they get Alfred Morris involved, but I'm not buying the Alfred Morris thing. We know who Alfred Morris is. He's a journeyman running back. He's a veteran. They know who he is. He doesn't have any future on this team. Come this time next year, it's going to be Jarek McKinnon and Matt Breida and maybe Jeff Wilson. They need to see what they have in this kid. Maria, it seems like every year this happens, but especially this year, we have like these undrafted rookie free agents just popping up out of nowhere. Guys like Philip Lindsay, guys like Gus Edwards of the Baltimore Ravens. And now Jeff Wilson is just another one of those products. For those of you who've never heard of Jeff Wilson, here's what you need to know. Four year back at North, uh, at North Texas, over 3,200 rushing yards, 32 rushing touchdowns, 70 receptions. So he does a little bit of everything. He had 16 rushing touchdowns in his final season at North Texas. Uh, he could catch the ball a little bit. We just saw that in this past week. 15 carries, 61 yards against the Seahawks, 9 targets, 8 receptions, an additional 73 receiving yards. So you're giving me a running back here with 15 to 20 touch volume even in a questionable matchup against the Denver Broncos, sign me up all day. I think he's in the flex discussion right away. I'm not buying Alfred Morris. He, uh, Jeff Wilson played 72% of the snaps in this game with Matt Breida banged up. So we get 70% of the snaps again, 15 to 20 touches. It doesn't matter who the matchup is. I'm buying in on Jeff Wilson. Sounds like the 49ers found a hidden gem, and Jeff Wilson looks to be the guy moving forward. Check him out on the waiver wire.